Thanks very much. I've got uh, an important question here. came in at the end, but I think maybe it's the, one of the most important questions, which says, how, or what and how would you answer a person in our community who believes you can't ignore evolution? What do you do to counteract it? So what, what do we do if we find, you know, one of our brethren, one of our young people, uh, is, is going down this road? Uh, well, you know, it's not uh, a new experience for me. I uh, uh, probably have had many such experiences of, of what to do. I think the first thing is we should uh, open our Bibles. We should uh, sit down, if people are willing to, to look at the Bible teaching. Uh, but if it was a young person, I would be trying to give them advice, really, about not spending their days with their heads in, into their chat rooms because I think this is absolutely destructive of normal, normal life anyway. You know, I mean, it, we don't have to, do we? Look, I've got two, two sons in California, neither of whom uh, allow their children to go on uh, social media, all right? You, you don't have to, right? It's a dereliction of duty to encourage or allow our young people to have free reign on social media because there's all sorts of rubbish out there which is just so destructive of anything that is wholesome. So why would we? And the other thing I say is that the ecclesias and the ranging brethren of ecclesias need to wise up and need to do some homework and need to, in a, a shepherding way, with a proper spirit, you don't want to crush poor young people who've got a question. You want to say, you know, they're so scared to answer it in case they, we come down on that with a ton of bricks that, that they don't mention anything. We need to create an environment which they can raise concerns because whether it's on the internet or in school or college, they come up with questions and we need in the right spirit to try to answer that. And I think the answers are there. Sometimes the answers, I don't know where dinosaurs came from, by the way, uh, or, or rather not where they came from, but where they went. I, I, I don't know. And... Is that a, an admission of defeat? I'm happy to live with that question until the Lord comes, right? And there's a thousand other questions I'm happy to live with. It doesn't uh, bother me. <laughs> if it does bother you, then I think there's a whole load of stuff you can uh, purchase there. <laughs>